million miles away Yeah, I'm already synthetic drip but it's from one of our most favorite companies and it is sam's beauty i'm so used to them selling a synthetic drip not only send me this little bed head you know housewife not desperate unit that's on my head this is patrice by altray it's already been uploaded they also sent us over another one this one i'm a little nervous about i can't lie okay it's not you know synthetic but it ain't no part why my lips so tight? Bam, here it is. Thank you, Sam's Beauty, for sending it over regardless. This one is in the style Jet, J-E-T. And I'm trying to see the name of the company, y'all. The name of the company is Glam 2. Yeah, I think that's what... Look, I'm going to put a direct look in the description box. It's in the style Jet, and I got it in the color Natural. It's an instant fab, 100% human hair wig, which I guess going to give you style and versatility. It says it's made of 100% human hair. It's lightweight and flexible, full and dense, soft and comfortable. Perfect for daily use. So the style is jet and the color is natural. But I want to say that this is, the company is a Glam 2, Glam 21 USA. That might be wrong. Girl, shut up. Go look at the description box. Okay, praise the Lord. Ain't no lace to cut off. Ain't none of that to show you, okay? Ain't nothing but the wig. All right, so I'm going to be honest. I get nervous when it comes to wigs like this because they come across as real. And I'm not trying to be offensive. Usher board fresh. They, like they, that's what they come across as. I got to cut out this little tab. And it's not that there's anything wrong with being on the Usher board. It's not that there's anything wrong, you know, with wearing a wig with no lace. To be honest with you, the reason why it makes me nervous, I'm not good enough with wigs to, to slay it normally. So it'd be just plopped on my head. Like this one just plopped on my head. Look. Mm -hmm. So let us see. Let's look at the cap construction on Jet. Fun facts. When I was pregnant with my um first son, that was the name that I actually was going to pick, Jet. But his name would have, last name would have been Brown. So his name would have been Jet Brown. And his daddy was like, just going to know. Okay. Anyway, this is the gap construction on Jet. You get a comb in the front and you get a comb in the back with adjustable straps. Okay. And this the little wig. Okay. Ain't that, why is y'all wasting time? <laughs> wasting time. Take that wig off. Y'all trying to, y'all trying to, you know, waste time. Y'all, I'm nervous. I ain't gonna lie. Let us hope this wig look all right. Because if it's not, you know I'm going to be like, ooh. And, and remember, I'm going to tell you, not that if the wig is bad, just because I can't style it, or if the wig is just bad. So, ain't no lace. Okay, this is a whole cap wig. Don't look up. Don't look up. Just put it on your head before you look up. Oh, okay. Y'all, I might be able to work with this, actually. Oh, yeah, y'all. I might be. I was nervous. Y'all, I was nervous. I was nervous. I was nervous. Y'all, and because this is human hair, y'all, you can. I wish the entanglement was here so he could shape this up for me. Oh, y'all, I actually really, really like this. Okay, but... Like I said, you're just going to have to shape it to your liking because to be honest with you, I would cut down these sides, of course, and then I would um, shave the back. Um, but before, yeah, I really actually like this a lot. That really is almost a throw on and go. And you can like 
Do all type? Yeah. Okay. This is instant fab. No, oh, nice. This is jet straight on. This side to the see that little curl making me mother the church. Pull it down, okay. This side to the right. So I will cut that down and I will shape the back. This is her to the left. I'm sure see in the back. And that's her in the back. I hope she's laying flat. Cause if she's not, that's the issue with the wig, because y'all know I ain't got no hair. Shut up. Y'all, this jaw nice. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. I mean, I know I'm going to keep it. I'm going to attempt to look. Look at these, look at these big country-ass scissors from Dollar General. Just trim it up a little bit. Mm-hmm, see that? That's all right. I got an automatic vacuum that's going to start in a minute, and I get that. Mm -hmm. And get that entanglement to shape the back. Y'all, I'm feeling like not mother of the church, the mother, period. Okay, first lady. I got to be sitting here in this darn lip gloss. Mm -hmm. There you go. Y'all, I definitely recommend this one. Mm. And because it's human, like I said, you can do so much to it. You know, I prefer a little messy look. I kind of feel like dead low for some, you know. Mm-hmm. This is good credit. I like this one. I definitely recommend it. And y'all, I was the most nervous about this one. That's why I was like, oof. Y'all, but I really like this. Y'all tell me how I look. Jessica, how do you look? Because you watch this for the first time as you putting that little video together at the front when you doing all this and that. How you look, girl? You thought you looked cute when you was filming it. How you look now? Mm -hmm. Y'all, I like this one. And Sam's Beauty, thank you for making me step outside of my comfort zone. Mm -hmm. Like I would say, maybe you're not even in twigs. Maybe it's your auntie, Monica. Mm-hmm. Maybe it's your uncle, you know, he throw. Period. Whichever one of me is sitting my way and we get them right. Me and Sam's beauty. I'm excited about this next one too. Mm -hmm. Until next time, y'all, would you be very soon? Bye. Mm -hmm.